Welcome to my first hit films tutorial. Hope this guide can help you to create a beauty of falling photos slideshow. If you like it appreciate a big like from you. Thank you for watching. First, create a image folder and import all the images needed to that folder. Create a new composite shot, 1920 by 1080 30 frame per second and name it as main. Create another composite shot, 1440 by 1080 and name it as photo 1. Create composite shot for BG, 1920 by 1080 30 frame per second and name it as BG. Close the BG window and click on Photo 1, Composite Shot tab. In the Photo 1 tab, add a plane layer. Drag the photo of your choice from the image folder to your Photo 1 tab. Don't worry if the photo is hidden. We going to create a mask over the photo. Click on the mask in the Viewer tab, and drag over the photo to match this size of the image. Now to create the border and reveal the photo, click on the mask in the Photo 1 tab. Click on Shape, Expansion and Input minus 50 pixel. And click Invert button of the Masked Mask to reveal the border. There you are. Next I going to scale it down to the rigot to fit the border. Click on the transform and scale in down to, oops. I am supposed to select the photo first, let's do it again. Select the photo, transform and scale it to the right size until it fits. Now close the photo one tab. Select the BG composite shot. Drop a desktop background into the BG tab and scale it to the size to your liking. Go back to photo 1 again and duplicate the photo 3 times. And rename them accordingly photo 2 and photo 3. Double on the photo 2 and delete the photo and change it to a different photo. Same goes to photo 3.
Now we have three photos composite shot. Select the all three of them can drop it into the main composite shot below the viewer window. One by one scale the three photos down to 35% in this example. Drop the BG composite shot into the main composite below three photos. We are going to give a drop shadow photo to give it a 3D look. Set distance to 20px. Penumbra to 50px. Copy and paste in into photo 2 and photo 3. And select all two of them and convert it to 3D layers. Zoom out your screen, we are going to drag the three photos out of the screen to make it look as it's falling from outside. We start with photo 1. Click and pull on the blue axis on photo 1 toward you to give it the height. The big the photo the higher it's from the table. Play around with the rotation if needed. Click on both the position and orientation in the transform section. Slide the time slider to zero and click on the toggle keyframe button. This will be our start position. Move the photo 1 to the tabletop as final position by adjusting the position X, Y, Z. Move the time slider forward to have the photo advance in line with the time. Push the blue axis downward to reduce the photo height from the table as it advance. Give it a rotation if needed for more realistic movement and click on the toggle keyframe again. I will do some minor adjustments on the keyframe to make it more realistic. Now 
Now move the time slider to see the animation created. I still need to do more adjustments. Sorry, still need to do more adjustments. Select all the key frame point and convert it to manual BZA. You can now adjust the speed of the animation to your liking by clicking on the value graph. You can make it to fall fast initially and slow down when it almost reaching the desktop. Do the same for the rest. 